Hey guys, sorry about the quality. It's my first videos for my YouTube channels. Please subscribe and like, try to, to help me to grow my channel. And today I'll show you how to make two stroke pipes in a thousand, with a thousand triples in the rev chassis. I'll show you that. Here what I did, I had a software on my PC to enter the CC strokes, everything what I, I need to run, RPMs. And it gave me a, a pipe straight and all those small pieces from one to seven. And this is the, the count, the, the headers. And you trace it on the metals. And after that, it came out like that. This is the, the headers, straight pipes. And after that, it goes to like that. I made three of each because it's a three cylinders, three piece of each, slowly. And before I did, before that was, I did my own pipes in papers. And slowly I cut piece by piece but this pipe was completely full and I was making sure it was fitting in, in the chassis for that bad boy. Thousand price motor built by PSW, Prusler World. So my plan is to make those three pipes go with theirs, go all the way up and go exit over there without cutting the hood. Yeah, sorry guys, I didn't film when I was building this this build. It's a complete rev with a 153 skids, already cats. All right guys, I'm gonna keep going with number nines. I just cut back the tapes where I started. And I will trace it on the middle. Make sure I don't cut. Do one piece by the piece. The plate take three of them on the middles. And when I get all my piece together, I'm just gonna start welding. Take weld them. Right. Number nine is ready. Should I put it straight? All right, not too bad. them now this the one it's over I'm gonna start cutting them now I'm gonna split all of them one by one
So I'm just gonna separate them. straight. Okay, there we go. I got the three piece done. Now I'm gonna switch to the rule benders to roll all of them and tack them together. Time should be good now. same piece they're identical those three pieces is gonna be for each three of the pipes I'm gonna weld them together just basically tag them right there so they stay like that I'm gonna do all of them
guys. When you're done, you go over to the bed sender. Turn that thing over. Gonna make sure this is flat and squares. Gonna do it on the side, right here. Slide this. When you put them together, when you basically use like a number, like we'll say like two, three, four, five, this is slowly bigger, bigger. So we'll say we'll take the number eight from last time I did it, and you put it with the number nine, like this. It goes on the top like that. When I pass it on the sand bender, it's just to make sure you don't see the daylights in between. So you don't see the daylight in between like that. So it's perfectly nice to weld. So, it, so this is gonna be, so we put piece after piece to make the curves. Finally got all the piece together. All of them, three times. So, I'm gonna start welding them together. First piece is done. Just tack weld them. So if I do a mistake or something wrong, so I can just grind them. We adjust it. So for now, uh, we'll just keep going. After four piece well together, this is four piece, that one, that one, and that one. It is, we just tag welded it right now. Just make sure it fits properly. Weld those one with no filler. I just fusion the two middle together. It looks nice. Some place had to do it. So now I'm gonna pour it inside so the welder so it's smooth. Pour and polish basically. This is what it is so far. Start to look good. So after I'm done welding them together, I will pass the drum holes inside to clean the weld. You can see, but they're still nice, but I still gonna pour the weld so the flow is smooth. Yeah.
this is what it is after I will it all. This is the two other one are done as well. Alright, then I'm gonna start porting them. I'm gonna show you after when it's done. I did port all of them now. Way smoother. So hopefully this help for the flow. So now I'm gonna keep the wings with now we're at number five. Keep going three more on each and I'll show you the result after. This is where I'm at now. Do a few pieces again. Start to looking way better. I'll show you what it looks in the chassis so far. Put an angle like that. So it's gonna follow the two next pieces like this. Next is gonna go right like that. Follow and then with close. I'm gonna show you what it looks like the other side. See what it looks so far. It's gonna be three the same. Just put the second pipes in. Start to look good. So the hood's gonna, gonna close. All right, I'm gonna make the third one and I'll show you. I finally done the three pipes. Can't wait to show you guys. This has to, I need to do the three cones now. And that's it. But the three pipes are in. Fully welded. Very smooth and nice. I poured all of them. They're ported. Super nice and smooth inside. Just finished to weld the first cone of the mag pipe. I have the center pipes and the video pipes to do, but this is the cone for the mag pipe. So I'll weld together, so I'll show you right after.
I placed it temporarily with tapes just to make sure everything is correct and it looks good. Let me show you the other side. There it is. It's, it's, it's trying to send it smooth. And I need to finish my little piece to go to one inch. My second pipes, second pipe is gonna pass under here, like that, and the third one's gonna fall away here too. All right, I'm gonna weld them together. All right, the first pipe almost done, fully welded it. Just need to do the stinger now. I'm gonna put it in the chassis. Let's see if it still fits. Exactly what I wanted. Perfect fit. Pass right there, like that. There we go. This is the the second pipe, the center one. Right there. That's the one. This one it's done. The cone. Now I'm doing that cone. And this is the piece. All the piece to make that cone goes like where we talked earlier, right under right here. Gonna go, gonna go. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna cut them and show you with the little scissors over there. Try to be precise. All right, right now I'm trying to place all my piece and make it route it to the right place. So that's why I put tapes for now.
waiting. Waiting, guys. Our looks. Not too bad at all, I'm pretty sure. Gonna go in the third one's gonna come from right there. Oh yeah. I think that's the best I could do. Alright guys, I'm gonna do the, the third one now. Show you later. There we go. I did all the weld. Pretty damn nice. Go right there under there. The third one's gonna pass right here. I'll show you from the, the other side. What it looks like. So I could do twin pipe. 800 RS, 600 RS, stuff like that. Pretty much the same. With the, so I have to duplicate those pipes to this. All right, I'm gonna go to the third pipes now. guys the moment it's there finished the three pipes completely done welded and uh, yeah I spent about 50 55 hours just to make those two three pipes and I, I, I'm not even done the, the stinger I'm gonna show you guys that's the three pipes fit super smooth in the chassis three Stinger's gonna go over there, there, and that one is further. I'm gonna show you the other side. Right, blue pikes. Yeah. Come right like that. Show the side of the panels. Yep, guys, that's what it is, man. Huh? 